Dang. Oh, nice. I actually have some nice cars. Wow. Oh, dang. Oh, wait. Is this the China one? <gasps> oh, I need this one. Okay. Let's see what else they got. Dang. Cal Weathers. Louis Jinguil. Oh, Rich Mixon. I need a China one, so for a movie I'm working on, Racing Like a Hero. So we got those two. There's a cruise. Oh, should I should I get some of these? These are rare. Do I? Hmm. I don't know. This is the only uh, car stuff they have besides a uh, drag racing playset that I saw. Hmm. I don't know. I mean, I got them on Amazon for like 12 bucks, so. This one's tempting though. Uh, you know what? I mean, I can always just come back here another day, but I think I'll get these two for for this time around. So there are the scores. Um, there's nothing else around here that's cars though. So that's the only thing that they have. But um, yeah, I'm impressed with the selection that they have here, surprisingly, of cars. All the scavengers, some of the China. Uh, releases with no tape on the packaging really impressive and only for four bucks each that's like store price of HEB or Target around there it's not bad not bad at all see there's the the drag racing play set so what's funny is oh wait are there more cars over here oh they're matchbox oh, I'm just okay so yeah I was like down this hallway looking at the boys section here and then I looked forward and then I saw that and I was like, oh. all right, so I'm going back to the car section because I texted my brother and I told him, hey, found some cars. Is there any here that you want for your collection? And he was like, oh, get me Chick Hicks. I was like, why do you want Chick Hicks? He's like, oh, I want the Piston Cup. And now that I think about it, I kind of want a Chick Hicks too for the sake of the Piston Cup. <laughs> um, but anyways, let's see. I guess I'll get him this one. Oh, the Piston Cup looks terrible. Okay. There's another one, right? Yeah, there's two of each. Okay, it's the same thing. Whatever. Package is damaged. I don't know if he's gonna keep it in package or not, my little brother, but just get him that one. I'm so tempted to get this McQueen though. It's something about this McQueen and this specific packaging just catches my eye. Hmm. I don't know. Should I just get extras of each? I'm I'm just so tempted. I don't know why. I, I remember these three don't have uh, treaded tires, right? Treaded or tires with tread. I think that's how you say it. Um, I unboxed these three at the beach for the one year anniversary of racing like a fireball. I don't know if we have a China Mater. Oh my gosh. Man, I came so unprepared for this. I did not expect to find these, this specific case here. Let me text my brother real quick and ask him. <laughs> Okay, so I texted my brother, right? And I was like, do we have China Mater, right? Look at his eyes here, right? And then I thought it was the blister at first, but look at his eyes here. <laughs> what the heck? Technically an error? I don't know, but I'm, I kind of want to pick it up for the sake of the meme now. Oh my god. <laughs> That's hilarious. All right, so I was looking around, and then I also found this. Funny Talkers Louise Nash. Life's too short to take no for an answer. Right, River? Okay, so my hair is a mess. Uh, my dad is still inside shopping, so I came to the car. Almost forgot, like I did with my uncle, but he had like a little spray machine or whatnot. I'm gonna do it now by myself here. I, I really need to start bringing a tripod with me now. I don't bring a tripod with me, which is on uh, my bed because I'm not prepared. But yeah, we got some Germix still. Thank God. Um, yeah. I bought a shelf because as you guys knew in the last quarantine hunt video, I said I was going to look for a shelf. Couldn't find it, so I came all the way to this big lots. This is like 30 minutes away from where we live because the one that used to be where I live was like five minutes away and it was next to a Kmart and my local mall. But it shut down for some reason, so we came all the way over here. But by luck, 
Um, oh wait, the cars are at the very back. The, I found a bunch of cars, so I mean it was a win-win. At my other big lot, big lots, they just had the cars three synthetic rubber tires, um, demolition derby cars. Wait, should I still have this on in the car? I don't think so. But anyways, uh, yeah, I, I wasn't expecting a bunch of cars, but I ended up buying like uh, two Chick Hicks, a uh, Cal, a Cruz, a uh, Jackson the Mater error, a normal Mater, because I FaceTimed my little brother and he said, we don't have a classic Mater from China, neither a Luigi and Guido. So he FaceTimed me because I myself, <laughs> for some reason, I can't remember my own collection. So I called him, right? And that's when he FaceTimed me and he said, oh, look, these are the cars you have. And I was like, oh, thanks. I should have recorded that FaceTime call. It was hilarious. He was like, oh, you have this one. I was like, oh, do I have this one? He was like, no, you don't have this one. And I was, I was like saying, I even forgot the McQueens I have. I told him, hey, do I have the Rusty's Racing Center McQueen, the China one? He's like, uh, yeah, you do. You have the one from 2017 from Target. I was like, oh, okay, good. And so that was the end of it. But um, yeah, I bought like $30 of cars, I think, ish, mas o menos. But um, oh my gosh, like my hair is a mess. I really need to find a salon or somewhere. There's none around this area, but I've never been around here. Technically, okay, so they announced a few days ago actually that texas is technically out of quarantine but not really they're slowly starting to open things up again so technically i'm not really in quarantine anymore or i'm required to be i mean i am but i just need to wear the mask and the gloves and stuff i looked for gloves here nada ice cream was sold out here as well i didn't get any pictures but for some reason ice cream was sold out i don't know what that's about i should have asked why people are buying ice cream but um yeah got a shelf for more of my cars to put and i'm gonna be frequently updating my collection by the time i finish i mean it's just with all th th this whole quarantine thing i'm constantly reorganizing and reorganizing my room i have so much time on my hands so yeah i started it got to the point where i said hey mom i need another shelf and she's like another shelf she's like okay sure fine go look for one at walmart we went to walmart there was none it was when I recorded the last hunt, I believe. Yeah. And there was none, of course. So now my dad brought me to Big Lots and we found one. Um, the shelves I have are like a dark espresso or black color, I believe. They didn't have that color, but they had like a cherry color or something like that. But it looks really close to the black color shelves that I have. So I got it and it, the package was damaged. So instead of $35, I got it for $28. But um. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, again, like I said, I'm gonna, I'm trying to do these quarantine hunts to entertain you guys that are still in quarantine at least once a week. So, I mean, today is Tuesday the 21st. I'll probably upload this next week. So for the last month of May, I mean, April, my bad. All right, guys, so we're at my local HEB. Uh, my dad needed to come by uh, this thing for his arm or something. So we stopped by HEB, and I'm gonna look for gloves now that I'm here. But um, this is the car section. They got a lot of two packs. Waitress me and Tia, Francesco's uh, pity set, Maddie McGear with her mom, I think. Charlie Checker, race official Tom. The best one out of this batch though is Sweet Tea and Guido. And, uh, I already got those. I dropped this one. My bad. And oh, Iron Man, nice. Kevin. Riven, I don't know much about. I don't know if he's rare or not, but that's the only 2020 single that they have. Oh wait, there's a Danico Cruz there. So they're all kind of just scattered. Now that I'm remembering, my little brother asked me for a Mario Kart Bowser diecast for his collection, but I don't see it. <laughs> I don't see Bowser. I just see the Toy Story ones and that's it. Shy Guy. Peach, and then the normal Hot Wheels. Oh, nope, sorry, little bro, I don't see it. Just a bunch of trashy Hot Wheels. And then they got Buzz almost dabbing on them haters. <laughs> That's me whenever I get the hate comments. Okay, so there's another section right here, right? I was looking for the Hot Wheel for my little brother, right? And there's more cars here. There's a Camp Yay! Spinner, there's a Cruise Besoro, a lot more rarer in comparison to other die cast 
There's another one down here. That's um, Maddie McGear, Thailand. But it looks the same as the China one. And then another nice one down here. If I can grab it. It's a metallic Rex Reveler. Of course, it's not $9.97, but you know. Oh, this is another nice one. Bryn Imagier Gear. I don't know how to pronounce that name, but this one's a cool one. I don't know if there's anything else. I am getting my hands so covered in germs right now, but whatever. I got Germix in the car. Oh, this is another cool one. Carl Kletchen. I'm gonna take a picture of these real quick and make a little thumbnail or something. See you later. And that's gonna wrap up this week's vlog, guys. So thank you all so much for watching. Stay tuned for May's monthly unboxing coming out in a few days on May 30th, I believe. Um, I've got lots of cars to unbox from these past vlogs that we've gotten and found, as well as some Disney Store cars that, it, that are gonna come from shopdisney.com because Disney Store is closed. But um, yeah, thank you all so much for watching. Remember to stay safe. We're all in this together. Oh,